Hi guys, it's Sprout here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we have another free OC. Um, thank you guys so much for all the love and support on the last one. It really means a lot. These are extremely fun to make. I'm happy to give back to the community by giving free OCs and matching artwork and I'm happy you guys like watching the videos. So today we have Sycamore Wind. Sycamore Wind is a sturdy spruce colored cat with eyes the color of the forest and a snow colored brindle on their pelt. I'm not going to read the last part because I am not good at pronouncing things and I don't want to make fun of myself on the internet more than I already do. Um, so this video is a little bit longer. People ask that I kind of slow the video down. That way you guys can see what I'm doing, um, which is totally fine. So we're gonna try that, but I go back and forth a lot. Um, I'm not the best at morph making, so I try something, I see if I like it, I go back. Um, so what I recommend, instead of trying to follow exactly what I'm doing, is just get an overall inspiration for the character and just try to remake it from memory. And that way everyone's OC will be slightly different and you're also more than welcome to change it. And so if you're new to this whole free OC, you're like, what, what do you mean? Um, so this game is a warrior cat game where you can make, you know, cat OCs. And actually in game you can give people OCs. I just don't have the time to go around giving people. Um, usually actually during the premieres I try to. Um, so for like about 30 minutes um, right after the premiere, if you're in the chat, I go into a server, I link it, and anyone there I give the morph to. And then hopefully that way it can kind of spread throughout the, the servers, I guess. But... You can also just remake it for yourself. Also, if you are somehow watching this video and you don't play this game, um, you're still more than welcome to use the OC in art, in role play. Um, there is art at the very end that is made with a pit crew made by a wonderful user, which I will have um, the credit below and kind of at the end. And you can use that on any website. Um, these videos specifically are just for people, instead of using like stolen Google art, you know, use something that the you're allowed to use. And it kind of just um, maybe gives people an idea of like, I guess how like using art and icons and stuff on the internet works. Um, I know a lot of people who watch my video are younger and they might not have like, you know, internet experience. I'm trying to think of when I was younger. This video is long, so now I have to like come up with things to talk about. But when I was younger and on Neopets, I'm definitely guilty of using, you know, random anime pictures for my role play characters or um, random wolf pictures and I had no idea that they were stolen or people's OCs. I don't even think I understood OCs, but I think nowadays um, with everything being a little bit more advanced on the internet and more I guess organized, um, I think most people have a concept of like characters and stuff at least, maybe a little. But I'm hoping that this video can either inform someone who didn't understand characters or, um, you know, just maybe remind people. But, so with the game specifically, I mean, anyone can remake the morph and you're gonna have characters that look similar to other people and that's totally fine. Um, which, but, you know, I mean, in real life, there's only so many types of cats, you know? So I think it's okay to have cats that all look alike. I think it's a little bit more realistic, which is kind of cool. Um, another thing I wanted to talk about, which I'm now remembering is, so in the comments, a lot of people put um, OCs and I am not sure if people are putting their personal OCs just to show me or if they're putting free OCs for people to use. I think it's mostly people putting free OCs to use, but just in case people are putting like their own personal OCs, that's why I don't pick people in the comments to make free OCs of because I would hate to accidentally pick someone, make a whole free OC and pretty much give away their personal OC. You know what I mean? Um, it just seems a little, ooh, too, I, I'm too worried. Or, you know, if someone maybe in the comments is using someone else's OC, but that way, if I use this uh, random generator, I, there's no chance of me accidentally, like, purposefully stealing someone's OC. Um, it's just truly a randomly generated character and I was just really inspired by just like the the word sturdy as an OC and um having like a dark colored coat but like snow colored um here's the final turnaround for him oh I'm fixing his uh, eyes but I didn't really want to use white uh, so I tried to use like a really light cream color and I'm pretty happy with how he came out his face is really unique I think I, I like mixed a few different to try but I tried to make like splotches, I guess, around his eyes. 
but I really like Sycamore Wind, and uh, as you will see with the end end music, um, he like as soon as I saw the name Sycamore Wind, I thought of Professor Sycamore for Pokemon because it's one of my favorite like Pokemon professors and the music. And I played X a lot, and it has really good memories for me. So, without further ado, I present to you sycamore wind he i think he could be a very cool warrior for any clan or maybe a rogue turned warrior maybe his name is sycamore and maybe he's he could be french if you wanted to i don't know i there's so many cool ideas with him and if you would like to see me do something with him kind of like i did with gold curse even though it was actually autumn hearts video but gold curse hijacked it if you don't know what i'm talking about you should go watch that video because it's pretty good but if you'd like to see me do something with him let me know if you do something with him let me know if you like this video uh feel free to subscribe i do videos like this all the time we have a cool little um you know channel here in community and we play work hats it's it's fun but um i will see you guys all next time bye